One day, one of the sheikhs was asked, is it more beneficial to read the Quran or to listen to the Quran? Good question, right? Is it more beneficial to read it or to listen to it? The true answer is both of them are beneficial, but the reward is connected to the impact you allowed it to have on you. So if I read it and there's no impact, what reward do you have? And if I listened to it and it changed my life, Wallahi, that reward is connected to the change and everything that happened. Although the hadith speaks about a special 10 rewards for every letter that is read, that we cannot deny. My brothers, my sisters, do good. We can't waste the, de- the, the moments of Ramadan. We can't waste the moments of Ramadan because you know what? For some of us, this is the last Ramadan. And for some of the some, they won't even see the end of this Ramadan from amongst us here. Who? I don't know. Could be me, could be you, could be anyone. Why waste it? And I said some, but you know what? Could be a lot of us. Who knows? Before the virus came, it was quite difficult to explain to people that, you know, you could die at any time. When the virus came, you see someone healthy, you meet them two weeks, two weeks later. Rahmatullahi alayhi. At least they are saying Rahmatullahi alayhi. May Allah have mercy on them. It could be me, it could be you, it could be anyone. That day, I don't want to regret having wasted Ramadan. Whether it's on movies or whatever else it might be. My brothers, it is a month of ibadah. It's a month of drawing close to Allah, changing yourself, improving yourself, becoming more easygoing than you are. Reach out to people. Your wealth will never deplete if you give it in charity. Give out in charity. Don't worry. Give people who are in need. Allah will give you. Anfiq yabna Adam unfiq alayk. Hadith Qudsi. Spend, O son of Adam, I will spend on you. That's what Allah says. Give, I will give you. Give, I will give you. That too, we are taught a balance. I mean, don't just go home and take your whole bank account and say, give it, Allah will give us. You spend. We're not saying give everything. It's a hadith, it's a verse of the Quran. Allah Almighty is telling Nabi Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, you know, don't be miserly and don't just give everything. It, it should be a balance between the two. But give. Many of us, you know, the more we have, the less we give. It is happening. Because we want, we have other plans. I'm going to do this, do that. You don't know before all of those plans, Allah has a plan to take you back to Him. Can happen, right? May Allah grant us happiness, goodness, ease. May Allah help us to accept His decree. May Allah bless those who don't have children with children. May Allah bless those who don't have spouses with spouses. MashaAllah. Spouses, that's correct, right? It's not spice. No, they say this plur- the plural of mouse is mice. So this plural of spouse, shouldn't it be spice? I think it's spouses like houses, right? That's what it is, yeah. But it is spicy anyway. 